Hey, what is going on, road trippers? Road trip Nate here, once again. Welcome back to the channel. Tonight, as those captions at the top stated, we are going to do a POV from my TV and talk about Fire in the Hole. Fire in the Hole is closing after this season at Silver Dollar City. <clears throat> it is the oldest operating ride at Silver Dollar City. It is a it's a fun ride. Let's see. Phone right here. Let's see. Let me see. When was Fire and Hope built? It was built in 1972. It is an enclosed roller coaster located at Silver Dollar City in Branson. Three stories. It is the oldest continuously operating ride Silver Dollar City has until the end of the season. Now, I'm going to show y'all the POV of the ride, but I need to get down there to Silver Dollar City to get a POV on this myself. My GoPro Gen 8. And I got a few accessories to make sure my GoPro stays intact, but I need to get up there and ride it so I have my own POV. So I don't have to look on YouTube to find other people's POVs. But with that in mind, because this is the last season for Fire in the Hole. One of the trademark Silver Dollar City attractions. They're tearing it down after this season. So I thought I would do a short little video, a short live stream to talk about and show Fire in the Hole, which is the oldest, like I've said, the oldest operating attraction at Silver Dollar City. Silver Dollar City is my favorite theme park. It was my family's go-to vacation destination as a kid. So let's, let's do what we did a few years ago. I just recently re-watched that video. What I did a few years ago, moved my laptop in front of the TV and showed the POV. Let's do that.
Yeah, it's, it's a dark ride. Touch the foot, touch the foot. <clears throat> yeah, hopefully that video came out all right. I just wanted to do that video just because this is the last year Fire in the Hole is going to be open. So. <laughs> so it's just kind of nice to show a historic landmark roller coaster. And talk about it for a little bit. For a few minutes. We're almost at 10 minutes. But, Fire in the Hole was, was built in 1972. I was born in 1989. Fire in the Hole has been that iconic indoor coaster for Silver Dollar City. My entire life. I'm 34 years old. I have honestly waited probably almost close to two hours to even ride this ride. Just a year and a half, two years ago, maybe. But, like I said, with my GoPro, and it's upside down again, with my GoPro that I got today, yesterday, in the shop, somebody sold to us, so I was like, okay, in a week it's going to come out for sale. I'm buying it as a new camera. I have, uh, let's 
somehow I can put this on myself. Or I can use this as a... So I've got attachments for it. I don't know if it has an SD card or not. I may have to buy an SD card for it, but one time during this season, I'm gonna have to get in there and get a POV. And we're backwards on my GoPro. Because, you know me, I like having stuff with cam cameras. Different cameras so I can do different things for my YouTube channel. So we're gonna have to do a POV of Fire in the Hole. One time. Before it completely closes. That way I give you all my experience. But that's what I wanted to talk about was Fire in the Hole's last hoorah, so to speak. Anyway, that's gonna do it for today. If you're new here, please feel free to hit that subscribe button after the video to stay notified on all my current and future whereabouts. And if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. It lets me know you care. And it helps support the channel. This is Road Trip Nate saying, as always, bye from the casa. Until next time, Road Trippers. Be nice to each other.